I'm just so proud of everybody, man. Uh, our team, uh, I just wouldn't, I wouldn't, wouldn't want to be in this position with another group of guys. We worked so hard. Uh, I'm just so happy for the first time. We came in here. Uh, Turned this program into a Sweet 16 program, man. I'm just so, so proud of you. And this, this, that's what we do. What happened in the second half? I mean, you guys could not miss. The defense was like it was against Marquette. What happened? Uh, just what we've been saying, you know, we make our defense, our offense out of our defense, and uh, you know we got to stay consistent. Uh, you know, we, uh, I think we played pretty good defense in the first half, and uh, you know made them take tough shots. You know they made tough shots, uh, just as a great team does. And you know we just stayed consistent, and uh, you know came out with the belt. Did you, when, like did you, when did you know you had them? Uh, I mean, we was confident coming into the game. You know, we never, never had any doubt uh, in our team. Uh, you know, we have the utmost faith in our team and our coaching staff. Uh, you know that we can go out. And beat anybody. Talk about the balance in the second half. It was you hitting a shot. It was Dwayne hitting a shot. It looked like it was somebody different on every single play. Absolutely. You know, it, it takes a team to win. Uh, and we know that. You know, we we have our leaders in Darius Thornwell. Uh, you know, but we also have everybody else that can come out and, and fill up the stat sheet. Uh, you know, and Dwayne makes big shots for us, and that's what he did today. What was that like running over to the, the fan section right after that and celebrating with them? I'm still speechless, man. I, honestly, yeah. I'm I'm trying to take it all in. I don't think it really hit me yet, but um, you know, just we thank them so much, man. You know, the fans they had they had it rocking today. Uh, you know, we we had the atmosphere. You know, you, you can feel it, and we just appreciate them and all that they do for us. And you know, we come out and play hard for them, just as we did today. What was Frank's message throughout the game? He was extremely passionate, always yelling, very animated. What what was what was he saying to you guys when you guys were down? What was he saying to you when you were up? It, it just told us to, you know, stay the course. You know, we were playing great defense, and that's what we hang our hats on. Uh, you know, he continued to say, we got to make shots, we got to make shots. And after we started making shots, you know, we, the, the outcome was great for us. Congratulations. Thank you so much. I feel like playing in this arena. I mean, you know, we talked about yesterday, maybe some North Carolina fans cheering for you guys. They were. I mean, what did it feel like being out there with that? The atmosphere was amazing, man. Uh, I've never played in front of a, a crowd like that before. Uh, you know, we just thank them so much. Uh, you know that they came to Greenville to support. Uh, you know even the fans that weren't wearing South Carolina colors. Uh, you know we thank them as well. Um, so you know just just playing in front of a crowd like that, you know it's a dream come true. You guys have made history now twice. Things you haven't done in 44 years. What do you want to do next? Continue to win. You know we, it's not over for us. You know we know that we, we're going to continue to push, continue to grind, and hopefully continue to get some wins. PJ, can you talk to us about what that was like?